Hi again. Um, this is a really exciting week for my wife and I, my family. Uh, we're finally going to close on our new home. We're super thrilled. I'm going to talk about that here in just a moment. I hope everybody else has had a great week. Um, the market has not had that great of a week. It's been quite volatile. Um, it's systemic risk, 100%. Uh, I think everybody understands what's the controversy within the uh, Trump administration in Washington and it is affecting the market somewhat and that again is classic systemic risk. How do you deal with systemic risk? You just ride it out. I, I mean it's it's part of a f having a good financial plan is having the ability to ride those things out. So um, if, if you don't have a good plan in place beforehand before these kinds of things happen then certainly it's gonna it can be much more scary for you. Uh, one of the reasons we recommend working with an advisor. So back to the house closing. Um, we're super excited. We're going to close on it this week. I think going into the process, um, well, the reason I want to talk about this is we've been having running this series of why hire a financial advisor or why work with a financial advisor. And I think you can in some ways equate that to a realtor. You can buy a home yourself. And for a brief moment, I considered it. Um, but what I discovered along the way was the value she brought to the table was in the little things. It wasn't in the big things. I mean, yes, you can look on HAR.com and find your house and you could probably muddle through a way to make an offer. But the key relationships that she brought to the table, um, the money saved through those key relationships, the um, negotiating skills that she brought to the table, everything that she brought to the table added much more value than my expectations. Uh, we're at really. So I think hiring a financial advisor is the same way. Um, yes, you can buy a stock, you can buy a mutual fund, and certainly um, you can read lots of articles on how long, you know, how to buy it, where to buy it, um, but it's the little things. It's the little things that make big differences down the road. And certainly when it comes to your financial planning, no question it's the little things. We, just like a realtor, we have key relationships with other professionals that can help you. Um, we, we've, had, we've experienced multiple things with other clients along the way that we can help you avoid. Um, part of working with an advisor is using their knowledge of possible mistakes to help you navigate away from them so you don't have to experience them. Very much the same with a realtor, I think. Um, so when you're hiring an advisor, you have to keep in mind sometimes you can't measure their value in dollars. You can't measure their value in investment return. There's other things involved with that relationship. Um, so keep that in mind. Uh, by the way, if, you, if anyone out there needs a good recommendation for a realtor, uh, the one we used was fantastic. I'd love to give you her name. Um, hope you have a great week. Look forward to seeing you next week.